Hi, I'm Dr. Nick Radio. I'm a Vice President of Research and Development here at the Clarion Research Group. My primary responsibility is the research and development of clinically oriented products. Inside the kit, there is four different vials. Those vials are to collect the saliva specimen. We look at the four different vials so that we can evaluate these hormones over a series of time, whether or not they're going up or down. Um, there's also a, a Ziploc bag that's just there for uh, transport purposes. And also for the person's convenience, we have already paid envelope. You would take the, the collected materials, put them in the bag, and at that point send them to Hormonal Clarity Diagnostics for processing. The Hormonal Clarity Diagnostics Patient Report, it contains all of the information that the physician would need to interpret the report as well as the hormones that were specified. Some of this information, of course we want to know the gender for the hormones that are being evaluated, the date of birth, the height, weight, and this information is necessary just so that we know how to um, evaluate your values relative to people that are of the same age range and gender. We also have on it the, the time that it was collected and the different time points because you'll notice for hormones like the cortisol, again, we're evaluating it across four separate time points because of that diurnal release that you'll find with cortisol throughout the day. The actual values, they're shown both quantitatively as well as in graph form. And what you'll see is that the patient's values are listed and then we have a reported range just to the right of that. That reported range is apparently healthy individuals. These are individuals that pass a series of criteria so that we can say that in this population range, this is how your values would compare to somebody in that range that is not reporting any symptoms. We're excited to add three additional hormones to the Hormonal Clarity Portfolio. This is E1 estrone, E3 estriol, and DHEAS. Why we feel that these hormones are so important for us is that E1 and E3 complement the estradiol or E2 hormone that we already offer. This allows us to look at the ratios that could tell us different predictors for that woman's health. The DHEAS is a precursor hormone for the androgens and estrogens, and we feel that for physiology, for fitness, it's a very good hormone to add to our portfolio. And with these, it, it allows us to have a much more comprehensive evaluation for how the hormonal levels in that person are going to be um, an indicator for us of their fitness, health, and overall well-being. It means for the patient that we have a very accurate fingerprint of exactly where their hormone levels are and how those hormones can potentially dictate or predict indicators of that person's health. The benefits with the saliva testing are that they're accurate, they are non-invasive, and they give us the ability to look at the bioactive or free hormone that is circulating throughout the body. And you know, they can be the entire process can be done in somebody's home as opposed to a clinical setting and then just drop off and mail the, the materials to Hormonal Clarity for analysis.